Hi friends, how are you? I hope that you're all fine. You're welcome to Miss Rachel's Learning Corner. Do we have new friends in here? We like to make new friends. Shall we welcome our friends? Welcome friends, welcome friends, welcome. Let us learn together. How are you? How are you? How are you today? How are you? How are you? I would like to know. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you very much. I'm fine. I'm fine. I hope you are too. Hello boys. How are you? How are you? How are you? Hello boys. How are you? How are you today? All the boys fine. Hello girls. How are you? How are you? How are you? Hello girls. How are you? How are you today? All the girls fine. Well done. I can see we are all fine and ready for our class today. In today's lesson, we are going to learn simple addition. Now we know how to do number value. We can count and match. We can count and write. We can count and circle. And we can do many activities with number value. Now we are comfortable doing what? Simple addition. So sit nicely and listen to Miss Rachel. Children, when we are learning addition, there are two signs that are very important for us to learn. And one of the sign is plus, plus and equals and equals. We have said this is plus. And what is the meaning of plus? And what do I mean when I say this is plus? Plus means put together. Put together or add together. Put together or add together. And when you add together, then you get total sum. Equals means total sum. For example, I have one mark pen. I have one mark pen. When I add another one here and put them together, it makes them how many? It, it makes them two. Let us count. One, two. One, two. I put it down. We can try another example. I have very beautiful red beads here. So I am going to put three. One, two, three. How many beads can you see? One, two, three. Then I am going to add two more. One and two. Three beads. Add Two beads. How many are they? We are going to count all of them and find out the answer. One, two, three, four, five. How many beads? One, two, three, four, five. Five beads. So I have put three beads here and I have added two and I have counted all of them, which makes them how many? Five. We can try with another example. I have one cup. This is one cup. And then I add two more. One and two. How many cups can you see? I have already put one here. Then I have added two more. So we put them together. We put them together. How many are they? Let us count. One, two, three. Again, one, two, three. Well done. 
we can try the last one. I have blue blocks. So, I am going to put two blocks. One, two. How many can you see? One, two. Then I add two blocks. One, two. How many can you see? One, two. Then what do I do? Because we are adding or we are putting together. I put all the blocks together. They are now friends. Let us now count. One, two, three, four. We count again. One, two, three, four. They are four blocks. Children, I hope now we understand what it means to add together or put together. Now we can try using numbers. What can you see? I have some addition sums here and what we are going to do, we are going to read the sum then we are going to work it out. We can try with balls or sticks and we are going to do both so that you see how it is done. We read two plus two equals this box here is where you're going to write your answer we read again two plus two equals so what are we going to do we're going to start here how many balls am i going to draw for number two two balls i draw one two then i come to this number what number is this Number two, I draw two balls. One, two. Then what am I supposed to do? I count all of them together. I start one, two, three, four. How many are they? They are four. I come here and write number four inside the box. Then I go to the next sum. I read one plus one equals, sorry, one plus one equals. Then what am I supposed to do? I am going to start working it out. I start here. This is number one. How many balls will I draw for number one? One. One ball. Then I come here. How many balls? One. One. Now, I am done drawing the balls. What am I supposed to do? I count all of them together. One, two. Or you can count with dots. One, two. I come here and write two. Let us try another one. We have some other sums here. And what are we going to do? We read first. Six plus one equals. Again, six plus one equals so what are we supposed to do we come here how many balls are we drawing for number six six balls one two three four five six six balls what about here this is number one i draw one then we do what we count all of them together or we put all of them together. These ones and this one. Let us count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got the answer. The answer is seven. Let us try this one. Let us read five plus three equals five plus three equals i come and start here how many balls will i draw for number five i start counting one two three four five uh-huh then i come here this is number three how many balls will i draw for number three three balls one two three then you ask yourself what will I do after drawing all the balls on this number and this number? I count all of them together or I add them together. Let's add them together. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I found the answer. The answer is eight. So easy. Now we can try working out the sums using sticks. You can either use balls or you can use sticks to work out your sums. Let us now try learning addition using sticks. We have already done addition with balls and we can also try addition with sticks. That is another way that you can work out your sums. And what did we say? Before you work out your sum, make sure you read first. Let us read 4 plus 3 equals 4 plus 3 equals. And we said inside this square, this is where you're going to write your answer. So we start here. This is number 4. How many sticks for number 4? Four? 4 sticks. 1, 2, 3, 4. I come to number three. How many sticks for number three? Three sticks. One, two, three. Then what will I do after that? I count all of them together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. How many sticks are they? They are seven. I write my answer. Then I come to this sum. I read first. Five plus one equals five plus one equals what will i do i draw five sticks one two three four five what about here one stick one then i do what i count all of them together uh-huh one two three four five six i come and write six wonderful then we try the last one we read two plus three equals two plus three equals i do what i come here i ask myself this is number number two i draw two sticks one two then I do what? I come to this number. I do what? I draw three sticks. One, two, three. Then I count all of them together. I count one, two, three, four, five. They are five sticks. Super easy. Wow, what a wonderful activity. Addition is Fun. You know what, children? The only trick to learning addition very fast is knowing number value. When you know number value, it is very easy to do addition sums. And you know what? Right now, you might try with sticks, you might try with balls, you might try with pictures and after you're done learning all that very soon you'll be able to do addition without drawing pictures because now you'll have known how to do mental sums but now let us try doing addition using balls sticks and pictures until we get to understand and that way we will be able to move to the next Level. It has been awesome having you in class today in Miss Rachel's Learning Corner. I can't wait to see you in another lesson. From me, it's a big huggy. Everybody give me a very big huggy. Twinkling stars.